Hello, this is Commander Schoolboy and I am going to talk about Elite OCR and Sloppy's Best Profit Calculator or BPC. So I mean most I'm expecting most of you guys to know how to use both these apps. Um but maybe you might be having problems importing information from one to the other. Uh, so basically I'm just gonna go through this as Today I was in Zaragrass station uh, system. Uh, the only information is Jennifer's hub, and I, there's nothing on Morin's hub. So I am going to put this information into BPC. Market so update completed. Thank you. So if we go into Elite OCR, you've taken your screenshots. I'm just going to add all of this information in. So those five screenshots and obviously I'm sure you've all done this so the system comes up and we go OCR in progress um, well, Elite OCR has been really good recently uh, with the update uh, make sure in the settings and preference you've got automated results and saves so I'll have all these all ticked because uh, then it will remember how the how how the recognition is actually much better if you have those take because it takes screenshots and basically remembers uh, any sort of issues that you might have. So it tends to kind of run through each screenshot now without any hitch. There's a few, mainly a few keywords. Uh, I can skip this bottom one because it's messed up. Uh, yeah, it used to have problems with eights and six, but that seems to be fixed in the latest version. I think it's four point five point one now. Uh, as you can see, there's no. I'm not, I'm not having any issues. So it's uh, automatically just going through them all and populating it uh, because I've got it in the settings to skip any that it's confident that it knows. So now that it's got that, uh, I, I I didn't know how to use this Trade Dangerous export, but what I've done is just click export, go in here, I normally save it in my Dropbox, and save a CSV file, press save. Uh, next thing you want to do is um, in Elite OCR, is just double click on the station name and control C, copy that. Uh, this way you have the exact name that you need. Now next you go into uh, uh, the BPC, add update, okay, it comes up with Jens for Hub and nothing else. So I am going to paste the name of the other station in there. Um, if I don't paste that and I try to load the uh, CSV file, Morin's Hub, if I open that, you'll see nothing comes up because it's actually looking for the station name to populate the commodities. So if I put Morin's Hub in there, load up the CSV file, open, there we go, and then if we click save data, <coughs> it'll do its uh, save, I suppose. So now if we do a search. Data upload completed. There we go. So last update, zero minutes for um, Zaragrass Morin's hub, and uh, basically it's showing all the commodities I can trade within 18 light year distance of me, and uh, I basically, well, you guys should know how to best see fit what you want to trade uh, around trips etc um, so hope this helps anyone else oh yeah so basically you can use round trip um, it's always best to if I clear clear this um, press current to where you are and basically just put in the distance of light year that you can travel how much cargo you got and credits obviously if you're doing a round trip um, and then show distance which is quite nice because you can see what's closest to you um, and then just do a search obviously so it's much quicker um, hopefully that will help you 
and help other commanders uh, with trading using BPC. Thank you very much for watching.